Today we're tackling something really important for your Shopify store, and that's ADA compliance. This is one of those things that a lot of people don't think about until it becomes a problem. But trust me, it's something that you wanna handle sooner rather than later. Making sure your site is accessible isn't just about avoiding legal trouble. It's about making sure that everyone can browse and shop on your website without struggling. I mean, just think about it. If someone with a visual impairment, limited mobility, or other accessibility needs tries to use your site and finds it impossible to navigate, they're not gonna stick around. They'll leave and probably never come back. Not to mention, websites that aren't ADA compliant can face lawsuits. And that's a headache that nobody wants. But here's the good news. You don't need to be a developer or a tech wizard to fix this. Shopify makes it easy to improve accessibility and the user way accessibility widget is one of the simplest tools to help you get there. So in this video, we're gonna go step by step through everything that you need to know. Why ADA compliance matters, how to install user ways accessibility widget and how to test your site to make sure that it's actually working. Stick with me and by the end of this video, your Shopify store will be way more accessible and you'll have a peace of mind knowing that you're doing the right thing. So let's get started. So let's start with the big question. Why does this even matter? A lot of people assume that ADA compliance is just some complicated legal thing that doesn't really apply to them. But the reality is accessibility affects real people. Picture someone who has trouble seeing small text or a person who can't use a mouse and has to navigate with the keyboard. If your site isn't designed with accessibility in mind, they could struggle to read your content use your checkout, or even understand what it is that you're selling. And here's the thing, this isn't just about doing the right thing, although that should be reason enough. There are real benefits to having an accessible website. Number one, it expands your audience. If your website's hard to use for a big portion of people, then you're losing out on potential customers. Simple as that. It improves user experience. So accessibility features don't just help people with disabilities. They can make your site easier to use for everyone, including older adults, people with temporary injuries, or even someone trying to shop with one hand while holding their coffee. It also helps with SEO. Google prioritizes websites that are easy to navigate and read. If your site has accessibility features, it can actually boost your search rankings, meaning more traffic and more sales. It protects you legally. Now, the number of lawsuits against businesses for having inaccessible websites is increasing every single year. And you don't wanna be caught off guard with a legal issue that could have been prevented. All right, so now that we've covered the why, let's talk about how you can start improving your Shopify store's accessibility. Installing UserWay's accessibility widget, automatic method. So one of the easiest ways to make your Shopify site more accessible is by installing UserWay's accessibility widget. This tool helps bring your store closer to ADA and WCAG compliance without requiring you to manually change your code. Finding UserWay in the Shopify app store. So the first thing that you need to do is head over to the Shopify app store. Now, if you don't already have a Shopify store, we'll have a link for you down in the description below where with just an email address, you can go ahead and get started on a free three-day trial. After that, your first three months are just $1. So now is a great time to get started with Shopify. I'll go ahead and create a, an account quickly here. Again, all you need for this free trial is an email address and a password. Okay, so once you are logged into your Shopify store, the first thing that you need to do is head over to the Shopify app store. So in the search bar, we're just gonna go ahead and type in user way. And right there, we can go ahead and see the user way website accessibility. So if we go ahead and click on that, it's gonna bring us over here to this page here where we can go ahead and click on install. So from here, we're gonna go ahead and click on install again once it's brought us back to our Shopify store. Store. Then here it's gonna say, ask us to confirm our email. So go ahead and go back to the email that you signed up with your Shopify store too. If this is your first time logging in to the UserWay app. Okay, once you have that code, go ahead and plug that in. And there you go. You are already logged in to your user way accessibility widget. All right, so after you go ahead and click on that, Shopify will handle most of the technical stuff for you. So just follow the on-screen instructions. Getting your login credentials. So once you've gone ahead and installed the app, you'll get an email from UserWay. This will include your username, password, and a special code that links the widget to your site. So if you've used UserWay before, you can skip this step and just log in with your existing credentials credentials, enabling and customizing the widget. So now comes the fun part, turning on the widget and making it match your site's look. So go ahead and scroll down to configure your user way widget section and you'll see an on off toggle. First, go ahead and just flip it to on and the accessibility widget will be live on your store. You can then customize how the widget looks. So you can choose different icon types, colors, sizes, and positioning to make sure that it blends in nicely with your website's design. So if we're here in the app, we'll go ahead and scroll on down here 
and it's currently set up to just the default settings here. It's kind of using UserWay's own blue color here. So for this, maybe we'll just click on this. You can go ahead and just type in the exact hex code if you have a specific color in mind, or you can go ahead and come in here and find one that you like. I'm gonna go with a bright yellow just so it's very visible. And we'll go ahead and switch to this option here. And then down here, this is where you can go ahead and choose where you want it on the screen. Now, typically there's a button or some sort of login or cart or search function in the top right corner. And then in the bottom right, you know, typically you have something like a sign up to my newsletter or a, you know, login sort of thing. So I kind of like the middle right option here or the middle left option. So uh, either way, you can go ahead and turn that on. And then also don't forget to go ahead and toggle this on. So this is to activate user way widget on your site. We definitely need to turn that on. And then we can go ahead and press save settings. You can also go ahead and change the color and type. So you want the small, the medium, or the large. We'll go ahead and just do the large just so you can see how big it is and go ahead and click on save settings, save successfully. So if we come over here to Shopify and let's go ahead, we'll click on view our, our online store. And there we go. Again, I just created the Shopify account. So this is just a very basic Dawn theme here. But as you can see, we have our user way accessibility widget over here. So if we go ahead and click on that, we can go ahead and see user way in action. So we can go ahead and change the contrast. So just by clicking it once that inverted the colors, we can go dark contrast or light contrast. And if we click it one more time, it'll get out of there. Now, if we want to make the text bigger, we can go ahead and click on it once, twice, three times, four times, and we can see it getting bigger. And if we go ahead and click that, it'll go back to its original size. So there's a ton of different options here. And again, this is all on the free widget. So it's really a no brainer. All right. So once you've set it up the way that you want, don't forget to save your settings, generating an accessibility statement. So another cool feature of user way is that it helps you generate an accessibility statement. And this is basically a document that explains what steps you've taken to make your site accessible. It's a good thing to have because it shows that you're making an effort, which can be used useful if you ever face any legal concerns. So to do this, just click on the accessibility statement tab in your UserWay account and fill out the details and then hit generate my accessibility statement. UserWay will email it to you and then you can go ahead and add this to your site. Testing your website. Now, once everything's set up, you should test your store to make sure that it's working properly. Click on the icon for your Shopify admin panel to preview your site and then just play around with the widget and see how it interacts with your pages. Installing UserWay's accessibility widget manual method. Now, if you prefer to have more control over the installation process, you can manually add the user way widget to your Shopify store, registering and getting your code. First, go ahead and click the link down in the description to get started with user way. And you can go ahead and sign up with a free trial. After you register your site, user way will give you an embed code that you'll need to add to your Shopify theme, adding the code to Shopify. So after you go ahead and get that code, log into your Shopify admin panel and go to online store and then themes. Before making changes, always create a backup of your theme by clicking actions and then duplicate. And once that's done, you can go ahead and select edit code and open the theme.liquid file. Scroll to the bottom where you see the tag and paste your user way accessibility code right above it. Hit save, then preview your site to make sure that the widget is working. So to go ahead and access that, we're gonna come back to our Shopify admin panel here. We'll go ahead and click on online store. We'll go ahead and click on themes and we'll come over here, click on these three little dots and click on duplicate. So now we have our copy of that theme. So we'll go ahead and let that copy itself. And then we'll come here to the three little dots again, click on edit code. So what we want to look for is the theme.liquid file here. And so we're going to scroll all the way down until we get to the end of the body section here. So here is where we want to go right here. So we see this body section right here. We'll go ahead and click enter a couple times there. And we created some space here. And right here, this is where you can go ahead and paste your code. And that is the manual way to go ahead and set up the user way accessibility widget. Why you should choose user way. So if you're serious about making your website accessible, user way is one of the best tools out there. Not only is it easy to install, but it also provides a ton of customization options to fit the needs of your site. Whether you're running a small personal blog or a large e-commerce platform, user way helps ensure that everyone can navigate your content without barriers. The free version of the widget already offers a lot of accessibility improvements, but if you're looking for more advanced features, upgrading to the AI powered user way pro widget can take your 
site to the next level. The pro version includes automated compliance scanning, AI-driven accessibility fixes, and a higher level of customization, ensuring that your website meets ADA and WCAG guidelines. At the end of the day, making your website more accessible isn't just about following the rules. It's about creating a better experience for everyone. And with UserWay, it's never been easier to do just that. So don't wait and get started with UserWay today by clicking the link down below in the description. So by now you should have a good understanding of why accessibility is important and how to improve your Shopify store's compliance. So whether you choose to install the UserWay accessibility widget automatically or manually, taking this step will make sure that your store is more welcoming to all of your customers. Making your site more accessible isn't just a nice thing to do. It's really a smart business move. A better experience for your visitors means more visitors, more sales, and better search rankings. Plus, you're protecting yourself from potential legal issues. So if you want to get started with UserWay, we'll have links for it down in the description below. This is an affiliate link, which means that we earn a small commission when you use it at no extra cost to you. And these commissions really help support the channel by allowing us to continue creating free content just like this. So if you end up using it, we thank you so much in advance. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss another video. Here on this channel, we make videos on how to succeed with e-commerce, so be be sure to subscribe. But other than that, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you here in the next video.